LeBron James and Bronny James have their moment. Now it's time to get down to business. Hello everyone and welcome to this short and to the point audio podcast. The stage was perfectly set for LeBron James and his son Bronny to make history as the first father-son duo to play in the NBA game during the Los Angeles Lakers season opener against Minnesota on Tuesday. Can senior and junior the first father and son to team up in MLB more than 30 years ago said a court site James wife Savannah and daughter Zuhuri were in attendance to make things even sweeter for the James it's happened to be Zuhuri 10th birthday uh, Lakers coach JJ Redick knew he was going to sub in Brownie late in the first half. The movement came with four minutes left in the second quarter and the Lakers up by 16 points. Father and Sir walk over the score table and ripped off their warm-ups. The sold-out crowd at Crypto.com Arena stood and cheered. Zahuri clasped her hands together and Greeny grinned widely. The following few minutes were less eventful. Brownie missed both of his short attempts, including a three-pointer of a pass from his father. He grabbed an offensive rebound. He guarded Timberwolves superstar Anthony Edwards briefly. He exited the game with one minute, uh, one minute left in the half uh, half time and did not return. But none of that mattered. More importantly, it was a dream come true for James, the oldest active player in the league at 39 whose goal was to play with his son, and it was a surreal moment for Brody, the 20 years old, 55th overall pick in the NBA draft in June. We didn't know if he did ever play basketball again, suffering a cardiac arrest in August 2023. Obviously, that moment, uh, that moment as, uh, as being the scorer table together and checking in together, something I will never forget to matter how old I get, no matter how memory may fade, as I get older or whatever, I will never forget the moment, said James, who finished with 16 points, 5 rebounds and 4 assists in the Lakers' 110-103 win. When both uh, uh, James and Brony were not playing, they sat next to each other on the bench. Few times James covered his face with a towel as he spoke to his son, so no um, obtrusive cameras could expose his words. After the game, James and Anthony Davis uh, whose locals are in next to each other talk football talk football as they dress which uh, often transpires after wins brony got dressed dressed silently the james and bronies walked into the interview room together and sat next to each other at the podium as they answered question from the media james was asked to recall how he felt ahead of his first game as a rookie with the cleveland Cavaliers in 2003 at the time he was only 18 years old who had already been dubbed the chosen one so guys, this is pretty much it. This short but to the point audio podcast. I hope you guys really like it. Kindly do subscribe to our YouTube channel. And thank you so much for watching.